Hi guys, I'm back with more information from our Lord Jesus, and sorry I've been gone for so long. I've had a lot, a lot of attacks still, and it just seems like it's one thing after another. I'll try to do a video and um, something else will happen. And so I just can't believe that it's taken me this long to get back on here. And so I'm pretty far behind on giving you all the information that the Lord gives me. And so I hope you're all well. And yeah, I just found out that I'm diabetic uh, just like a week or so ago. And um, my son's still having health problems. And then he was at a concert the other night that he called and said there was an active shooter at. And I was... Uh, freaking out, kind of find out they couldn't find the weapon or anything, so everything ended up being um, okay, but like I said, I was going to make the video that night, and then that ended up happening, so I couldn't, and it's just one thing after another after another. I don't know if you all are going through this, but it feels like I'm just being beat up, like in the corner, and I know I'm not. Um, I know we prevail and um, we're victorious, all that, but it just feels like it at the moment, so if you could uh, please pray for me and for my family, and for all these obstacles to be removed, that'd be great. And then, so I don't want to be any further behind. I wanted to get you guys caught up on what he's given me. And so I'll start out with a couple of dreams that I've had. I don't know what they mean. But um, as you can see, I have a, and I've been using gum in my last few videos because my mouth's dry from being diabetic. So that's probably why I sound funny, but I also had a seizure and my sleep last night I almost bit my tongue off and I'm having trouble with that today it's very sore so I'm sorry if I sound um, muffled but I wanted to give you this dream because I've had it like two weeks ago or more um, it's an octopus ride dream um, so I'm sitting at a cafe and it was at an amusement park so everybody at this cafe is um, like outside at these tables with umbrellas and this uh, octopus ride, as you can see here, it was an octopus, and it had octopus, uh, little octopus at the end of it. So they weren't, like, red like this. They looked like little octopuses. And it looked similar to this, but not quite. And so we're just sitting out there, and these cars start coming down on us. Actually, I think this uh, dream was a month ago or more. But So they start coming down on top of everybody. Um, one is just barely dangling, the one above me, and the others were just falling off, hitting everybody that was at the cafe with me or around me. And I'm running for the the gate to get out of this cafe, away from this falling ride. And uh, the gate saved me. So I'm going through the gate just as the octopus was hitting the both sides where the door is, basically right above my head. And I had dunked down and ran through the gate. So... There's more confirmation on us barely getting out right before things happen. And he's told me this many times. I keep getting um, from the Lord. He said, no easy way out. And I also heard, you'll have to go um, through hell to get to heaven. And what I think he means by that is these um, planets that are coming. Um, some are huge, so the gravity is very... Uh, different from earth so this thing spins really slow and as we've all been told um, you know like in hell it's like 40 years in hell is like four years on earth so I'm thinking that since they've always said you know Satan's in the second heaven and whatnot I'm thinking he's actually referring to these planets coming as um, some be in hell we have to go past them to get home and that's why so I got a real kind of a revelation about that from him and I think it's very interesting um, but I also saw uh, the sky on fire was flaming and it, it had 666 in it and that's when he started telling me about this system that's coming so I know that these planets that are coming first are the the bad ones and then we have to go past them to get to where we're going and I'm not sure um, all the details and all that yet, but I'll let you guys know. So I think that's what that dream meant. And then I have more on crocodiles. Um, like I told you last video, we're going to be up to our heinies and crocodiles. I got that. I keep getting something about the sea. Um, also deep sea. Um, also sailors and ships and um, things of that nature. I keep also, for some reason, I don't know if I gave you guys this already, um, getting cake. 
many references to cake. I don't know why. I think it's because a uh, flour shortage is upon us and we won't have any flour to make cake. Um, I also get oak lights, um, also lights, luminous, um, bright lights, and blinding lights. Um, so I don't know if that's, again, reference to uh, the supernova that we may have coming or um, to something else that may be um, a luminary, but I know that the 144 will also um, be extremely bright. Um, I had a dream that I was glowing, and I knew he was referencing um, the 144, or Chosen, or whatever you want to call him. Um, and I was trying to hide this light because uh, they were kind of being pursued and chased. And I've seen that dozens of times as well. Um, I don't know why I was trying to hide that. I think that um, they won't have all their gifts right away. So um, it would be hard to protect themselves at first. And the light comes before, you know, such gifts where you don't want them to really catch you. But um, eventually it won't matter because they'll be very powerful. And, and that's a, kind of a joke that anyone would try to catch one. And then um, here is kind of a picture of what that ride looked like. And then it had those uh, like little octopuses as cars on the end. So I kind of just screenshotted both to give you some idea of what I was seeing. And I, th I do think that he's re that was a double meaning. I think the ride is that they're coming and we narrowly escape uh, when the fallen ones show up. But also because um, there's going to be that kraken in the sea and so that was a double meaning on that and i do have a lot more to give you guys sorry that i have to just keep playing catch up because i meant to start making videos that were um shorter and just more of them but like i said i haven't even had a chance to do so and then i also noticed that um all my videos have been kind of grainy you can't really see where my camera keeps adjusting so i hope hopefully i got that fixed and that won't happen again but just in case, uh, know that I'm working on that and I know about it. And also, if uh, you guys need a Bible, I still have the same email even though I changed my channel name. So if you want to email me, I'll send you a Bible free of charge. You're going to need a hard copy. I don't know when, but I know it's coming soon. And I'll send that to you. Um, so just email me and put Bible in the you know subject line at watchwomanforjesus at gmail. And then I'll also leave my PayPal, Cash App, and um, a post office box. If anyone feels led by our Lord to help me, um, I can sure use it for personal reasons, but also um, to mail out Bibles. So if anyone feels led, and only if you're led, um, those are the three ways I have right now to help me. Okay, so you guys can see this too. It's something that came to pass that I gave. Uh, I said there, there's going to be a chocolate shortage. So I just happened to um, see this, a major candy factory, or McFactory, I can't talk, <laughs> manufacturer, geez, um, just warned of a huge shortage in the fall. So I don't know if that's every candy thing, you know, if it's just a chocolate shortage or if they're just saying for that company, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be everywhere. And then also remember... Um, condiments such as uh, spices, uh, ketchups, mustards, and um, even now flour he's given me. Uh, anything made with wheat um, will be shorted. Also, I think corn too. Um, I got that several times as well. And oats. Oatmeal, I get that all the time. If you guys need that stuff, get it now while you can. And also, there's going to be a synthetic rubber shortage. And so things that are made with any kind of silicone or rubber um, won't you can't get soon and I'm talking shoes tires um, baby bottles uh, pacifiers anything like that uh, will be shorted very soon I think he was just giving me extra time I didn't get much time with the um, baby formula shortage so I think it was like three months later that that started that he gave that to me so I just wanted to let you know um, so you guys can get these things um, so there was the octopus dream I had written down and then also I keep getting trains. Something about trains is going to happen. Um, I would have thought that riding on a train was safer than an airplane. And um, I no longer say that because I actually get more about trains than I do about airplanes. Also rats. I've seen uh, many, many rodents. I don't know if it's from all the flooding, but we're going to continue to have flooding. It's like we're living in the days of Noah. Um, I saw 
that I had a couple boats in one dream, and then um, so much water in other dreams. I'm so much water, and then also um, extreme droughts in other places, and then also I can't say this word, but I told you guys about a. Um, uh, I'm trying to think of a word I can use without saying it, but I'm going to zoom in on it. So, young people, um, I don't want to say S-C-H-O-O-L because they um, will not share this, and I, no one can leave a comment, but um, I just wanted to warn you about that same one. I got Eastview, and I believe it's uh, one in Minnesota that may be the next place. Um, I don't really know how to warn them without them thinking I'm nuts, but... I also got Georgetown um, University, which is, I think, in Washington, D.C. or that area. And so those are the only two I've ever received. But something's coming with this, and I've gotten several more warnings from the Lord about this. Also, I got a warning for nerve gas. Also, he keeps giving me the word poison, so I don't know really why. Um, also, myself and um, my son's girlfriend, who gets prophetic dreams as well, um, got Little King... Also, September, and in particular, I've gotten September so many times I can't count. But also, uh, September 16th was one I keep getting, and then Tucson, Arizona. So I think, I don't know who that is, but I think there's going to be a concert that night. And um, I'm just saying, if you plan to um, go to that event, please, you know, pray about it first. Because I wouldn't be surprised if something doesn't happen at that event. Uh, I keep getting it, so I wanted to give a warning on that. Also, I got several other places of concern. Um, the other night before uh, these um, northern lights, I guess, auroras, were going to be prevalent even in the southern areas, I got the word callers. And so it says I got this on 8 17 22, but I think it was a couple days before that. I got revelation on Bang a Gong. That is something to do with Nikola Tesla's work in time travel, I think. So, um, I guess, you know, the earth will ring like a bell or um, similar to a gong. And they use those in many religious rituals and different um, religions. Um, I'm not sure why he's um, showing me that, but I just know that I keep getting it. And then also I get radar over and over and bell, too. And then um, I got belted or belt. So I think that um, I've gotten several things about a cinch, like a cinch strap on a, uh, a horse saddle and um, belts with no holes. I got several words. And when I looked it up, it was like it means a belt with no holes. So and then I got belted as in buckle your belt. So there's going to be a belt shortage. I know that people will need them because they'll be losing weight. So if you can get an extra couple belts, but also know that the time has arrived to fasten your seatbelt. Also, I got sign from God coming now, um, several, several times. I got dogs, as you can see there on the right. And, um, I guess something already happened with that before I could get this video done. And many dogs were perishing in, um, uh, Michigan. And I had also gotten the word parvo. So he was letting me know why um, those dogs were sick. And I think the parvo has um, mutated. Um, also, I got, I can't really see that. Oh, that's just another one on the dogs. So I got dogs many times. And I didn't really know why he was giving me that. But then, um, obviously, it's about that. Um, again, I got trained again. So I don't really know. What's going to happen with that? And then, here's a, I almost forgot to tell you guys these. I got slides so many times. Also, um, rocks, uh, stones, rolling. Also, I heard a rolling, rolling, rolling many times in a dream. And something about a huge rock rolling. Also, California again. And Colorado again. And then, I keep hearing one track mind. Um, simple minds. And something about grown men crying. And then I got Florida, um, New Jersey, Philadelphia, and Paris, France. Or, yeah, I think it was Paris. Or I just got France, then I got Paris. And Nova Scotia, um, China, also Australia. And then Mozambique. I got that several times as well. And I know why um, I do get China a lot. Because they will eventually, with Russia, invade the United States or... 
well, yeah, that's how it's going to happen, but I don't know, you know, for how long or anything. Hopefully, not long. But I got high tides, uh, many waves roaring, so I got that. And something else, just earlier, before I done this um, video, he gave me. But I know uh, high tides are going to be a big, big thing. Um, that's going to be separate from the tsunamis I've seen. So high tides and... Um, these are just pictures of some of my dreams so that people can kind of get a idea of what I've seen. So I got a whole bunch more to share. I did get seven bridges, and I really think that's probably about um, these bridges. Because in the dream about the swimming pool with all the horrible water in it, um, the angel picked me up and set me on a bridge, and this water was just black that I was in. It had all nastiness, chemicals, uh, dead bodies. Um, you know, sickness, it was awful. And I was trying to get across this pool, so I just jumped in and was swimming really fast. And the angel picked me up, put me on a bridge, and then that gave me the idea of, oh, that's why I got seven bridges. I think that um, these planet system coming past ours, there'll be a bridge to, like, each one. And I think that's why he gave me um, seven bridges. I'm not, uh, you know, 100% positive on that, but I'm pretty sure. And then um, my husband just went outside. Every time he goes out, he's allergic to something right now. And that's what I mean about so many attacks. He's had, like, uh, I don't know, bronchitis or pneumonia. He was negative for COVID, but he keeps um, having this stuff with his lungs. And so if you can pray for him as well. Um, same with my son. Actually, I need prayer for both sons, my husband and myself. And then my mom was in the hospital. So I made three trips to the ER in three days. I had my husband there, then my mother, and then um, the eight-month-old baby um, who I I had at two ERs in two days. So it's crazy. It's like uh, I don't um, quit getting the attacks because they know I'm about to do a video that gives you guys information that apparently they don't want out. That's the only thing I can figure, and I hope to get more on most things that I've already given you uh, just now, but um, I don't know. If, you know, I just never know what he's going to give me, guys. Uh, I do pray and ask for certain things, but um, I get so much that I just keep moving on to the next instead of worrying about what, you know, he may or may haven't or may or may have given me. Um, so there's the bridges and then fire on the I-10. I think um, I've given you guys that before. Also, okay, um, I need to warn about this. I had a dream about horrible, horrible racism again in america i mean this was beyond disgusting i put and uh yeah um all the groups of old were back so the ones that were here before kind of like the um kkk the black panthers and all those things were all back somehow i don't know how but it was um uh that dream really concerned me it was really um horrible and I just can't imagine that we've all come this far to ever um, go back to that. I can't not imagine that. You can tell that evil is really in charge. And then also I got uh, 8, 12, 22. I got blowfish again. Um, also, uh, yeah, I don't know why I just put do me a solid because I kept hearing that. It's hilarious. It, the Lord is really funny. And then I got... Um, New York City again, California again, Seven Bridges in India, also Montgomery, Alabama. And then I got Mississippi so many times I lost count. And I know that it's about uh, flooding um, this time. And I think I might have gave that a little too late, but it's going to continue is why I'm um, saying it now. So if you're in Mississippi, please be aware that you're going to get more flooding. Also, uh, I kept getting ash. Also, um something about um there being an ash layer on the earth and then um crystal displacement so hopefully i can tell more on that in my next video and then even levitating rocks as the system gets closer uh we'll lose a lot of our gravity and these rocks were levitating and then um the lord was uh going over with me the battle of jericho where um the walls of jericho came down um you know it was about sound and things and then also, I got um, something revelation on these huge, huge rocks that were being moved. It was with certain vib um, frequencies 
sound frequency is what they use to move these huge heavy rocks that they use to make the pyramids and Stonehenge and um, Easter Island. So they used a certain sound frequency to raise up the rocks as these planets were near because the uh, gravity was less. And so uh, he gave me a lot of revelation on those type of things. And then I got walkers um, so many times, uh, referring to the zombies, also uh, dragons and what else? Um, yeah, I can't really even re read my own writing sometimes, guys. I write these while I'm asleep, um, so it's hard to read later. Some Sometimes I can, sometimes I can't. Um, I mean, I would be able to if I was to really look and study it for a minute. Um, I got, you were surrounded by imposters, and I saw medical workers that were not actual humans later. I don't know if that's now or if that's just later, but um, they were infilled with, I guess, demonic spirits. Also, uh, uh, turned to stone, and then he got gave me masons, masons, masons several times, and something about um, stones. So I don't really know why, but I guess uh, we'll find out soon. Many things I don't know about if I don't give you, it's uh, pretty important. Also, something about photographs. Again, I don't really know what that means either, but I think we're going to find out soon. And then, um, yeah, I got gave you a, that about gong and a bell. Also, I think I gave you all the locations that he gave me. So um, this is about 21 minutes, and... Um, I don't want to make each video too long, so what I'll do is I'll just try to be back on um, later with another video while everything seems to be kind of quiet. I don't want to jinx it, but everything seems quiet right now, and I'll probably just be back on later, or I'll go ahead and record it and then post it tomorrow or the next day. But I hope you're all well. I've been praying for you each and every night. I never forget that, and um, I guess I'll be back on soon, guys. I love you all. Shalom.